Hey guys, my name is Anand and welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a short video about Google Ads countdowns and I'm going to show you how exactly you can set up a countdown uh, and add it to your ad text. So what exactly is a countdown? Uh, many a times when you go online um, and when you search for something on google.com and uh, sometimes you know you get to see an ad that says hurry up offer ends in three days or download the PDF because the you know registration ends in two days or registration ends in three hours so the number that you get to see offer ends in three days two days one days those are all set up using countdown ads um, those are not separate ads those are those numbers change dynamically and uh, one of the most important reason to use countdown ads in your you know Google Ads is uh, it creates a sense of urgency uh, whenever you're marketing something and whenever you have a special event or a sale having a countdown um, you know ad or setting up a countdown uh, in your ad text will create a sense of urgency people will feel that okay I need to take an action right now before this this offer ends or I need to make use of this sale uh, or special event by clicking on it on the ad and uh, take an action on your website so countdown ads are super effective they create a sense of urgency and I, I highly recommend uh, using it whenever you have something to promote uh, whether it's a sale or a special event so let's get started and uh, let's see how to set up a countdown in your Google Ads. So the first step is to click on your campaign and uh, you can create a new campaign or edit an existing campaign. So I'm just going to select, uh, I'm just going to create a new one and select search. Uh, and in this case, uh, I want to promote sales. So um, I'm going to select sales and then my website. All right, hit continue. Um, so I'm going to exclude display network, um, keep the country as United States. This is fine. Um, budget can be ten dollars. All right, I think uh, you know you can play around with the settings uh, for the campaign, but I'm just going to keep it as, uh, keep it as it is. Okay, set up the ad group. Okay, I'll just paste a bunch of keywords like um, digital marketing course, digital marketing tutorials. Okay, I'm just gonna add two keywords in there and make it exact match. And then I'll make this phrase match. Uh, if you don't know what, what are the different keyword match types, um, there's a separate video in my YouTube channel. Alright, so this is where you will create your ad and um, so you first add your final URL and then over here you give your headline so you can say free digital marketing um, course download PDF hurry sale ends in okay and then what you do is you and you enter a curly bracket and then as soon as you add a curly bracket um, the second option is countdown so you select that okay now what you do is okay let me okay so as soon as you enter curly bracket you hit countdown okay so the first option is countdown ends so this is where you will select your end date or when you want your countdown to end. So um, right now um, it says sale end, ends in three days. So um, I'm going to say my, I want to end my countdown next Saturday. That's uh, 16th of February. Okay, that's fine. And then this is where you will see uh, set when do you want your countdown to start. So five days before countdown. So that's going to be one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So five days before the start. But let's say you want to start right away. Then what you can do is um, 
so that's one two three four five six seven so today is ninth so I'm gonna start it right away and you can um, set the exact time of when you want to end the countdown um, this is 24 hour time so right now it's gonna end on 16th of February midnight um, but you can change this as per your you know sale promotion or as per your special offer or event um, the next is uh, time zone so let's say you know you are promoting an offer in the East Coast or somewhere in New York uh, it's going to be in Eastern Standard Time uh, but if a person from California um, views that ad then you know he is three hours three hours behind so you need to take that into account so if you set account time zone um, then you know your ad will show the end date in Eastern Eastern time so uh, after like seven days uh, it will show six five four three two one and then it will get into hours so what I mean is it will say hurry sale ends in three hours two hours one hours so rather than you know selecting Eastern time you can select ad viewers time zone so that way uh, no matter where he is you know it will show the accurate time and it will show the exact time that is uh, going to match the local time from where the viewer is watching that ad so I always recommend using ad viewers time zone um, the next one is language you can choose like you know Dutch <laughs> and if you select Dutch look at this um, it's gonna change the text as well so I'm just gonna you know select English um, and then hit apply all right so as you can see, uh, this is the syntax, hurry, sale, ends, and bracket, countdown. So this is where it will show you when the countdown offer ends, uh, the time, the language is English, and um, it will say how many days before the countdown end date you need to start this ad, or it will, it will be effective. So that's how you know your countdown um, offer is going to work in Google Ads. And then what you can do is you can you can copy this as it is and you can also use it in your description so you can say uh, visit website and download the PDF and then it will say hurry sale ends in three days so that's how you know you can create a countdown ad um, and configure it in Google AdWords and as you can see this ad looks so much better than a normal you know text ad without any countdown text in it because this creates a sense of urgency it's it's clearly telling a call to action hurry the sale ends in three days or you know if it's a registration event then you can say hurry event registration closes in you know x number of days and that's how you know you can get some registrations on your website if you're selling event tickets you can promote your e-commerce store uh, if you are doing some kind of uh, you know special promotion and, and if you are promoting any kind of holiday offer like for Christmas or uh, New Year or you know Black Friday you can use this extension or sorry you can use this countdown feature to create that sense of urgency drive more traffic and hopefully get more conversions so that's it guys uh, for a quick video on countdowns and how to set up in Google AdWords thank you